G'day guys, welcome back. Today I'm out doing something a bit different. I'm out collecting freshwater mussels for bait. Now, I was out at this dam the other week looking for a few yabbies, but didn't have much success. But while I was out here, I noticed there was a few mussel shells in, around the edge of the water. So I'm back again today, it's a bit warmer. And I'm gonna see if I can find a few. And then we can look at using them for some bait. This one, there's the first one. That one's definitely alive, you can see it just on the outside. That's a smaller one. Yeah, that one closed. I wasn't sure if that was a dead one or not. Yeah, that one's alive. Looks like there's a couple burying themselves in under the dirt there. There's another one in under there, yep. Buried itself. Is this alive? No, it's a dead one. Oh, that's a big one. The size of that one. You can see these ones are alive. They've left the trail where they've moved around. This one's burying itself into the mud. Is that one in here? That's where it was. Oh, there's a bit of a hole. They've come out of the mud. There's another one. They're a bit hard to see in the water, but luckily enough, the water is clear enough. Is that one? Yeah, I think so, yep. Now, okay, there's a couple more. There's some big ones anyway. Oh, this is a bit slippery, this stuff. There we go. Dead one. It's a bit harder to see him here now. The water's getting dirty. I can feel a couple of my feet, I think. Here we go, just stood on one. Oh, that's a big one. All the size of that. Here's one, I think. There we go. You can feel them in the mud with your feet.
Ow, other than rocks. There we go, there's another one. Found it with my feet. And I think I'm standing on another one as well. Or is it a rock? Oh no, another one. Getting quite a few. Another one. Oh no. Yep. This feels like a smooth rock. That's a big one. Oh, there we have it. I'm gonna have to spend in a few minutes. Got quite a few mussels. All pretty decent size too. I thought there'd be a lot of smaller ones as well, but you know, they're all around the same size. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to see how we go um, using some of these as bait uncooked but also cook them up as well because that makes them a bit tougher. So we'll go cooking some up and we'll see how we go using them as bait. Let's have a closer look at what we've collected. Yeah we've got quite a few. Yeah done really well. 20 or 30 mussels there I'd say. I think you can eat them, but I'm assuming that they'll taste like mud if they're coming out of dam. So we're just going to use them for bait. But yeah, that's pretty good for only, was it, five, ten minutes?